on a one-on-three. He's persistent on the puck, but he knows he doesn't have anybody with him. Inside, outside, Armstrong knocks him down. That's a good 200 foot back check for Kobe Armstrong. Here's the play you just can't make. I mean, Boschman just a blind up the middle on a turnover. The bouncing puck he makes for a tough shot, but that's been a problem that has plagued his defense and this team. The most turnovers, second in the NHL during the year. Well, that was the hockey. Let's go out and grab a coffee. Hello everyone. Well, it's snowing. Um, thought I'd film this and take you guys on a Canadian adventure to Tim Hortons. Especially uh, with Dave and Rachel and Pete all being around for lunch at my family's house today. It's all settling on me. Um, and yeah, show you how cold it is here. It's actually not that cold, not as cold as it is with the wind. Been uh, homesick for the past couple of days. Um, there we go. See all the snow falling. Um, but I'm over it today. Don't know what it is. Probably Jim being at work and me being out of a routine or doing something useful and packing though Just press that button yeah, look at it all oh yeah just gonna show you what all the fuss is about anyway guys see you soon well here we are at the famous Tim Hortons still snowing sign isn't even lit up which is a bit of fail um, being an Australian, especially in Melbourne, I don't really like Tim Morton's that much. It's alright, I suppose it's typical American flavoured coffee. Uh, keeps you warm on a cold night like this. And the temperature has really dropped since I last vlogged. You can just see the moon up there and all my gears doing its work. Oh, there's some big flakes coming down now. Um, and as you can see, it's getting bigger and heavier. <sighs> anyway, guys, let's go order this coffee. G'day. Can I please have a uh, butter caramel uh, latte and a old-fashioned glazed donut? Thank you. Uh, medium. An old-fashioned glazed donut. That's all for you. That's it. Well, the coffee's okay. Warms you up at least. I'm going to head back or possibly go and frolic in the snow. It's really bad when it gets up your nose. I've never had snow go get up my nose before, but yeah, there we go. As you can see in the background, it's snowing quite heavily now, so it might actually start to settle. Warm enough, dry enough, and that's the key. Just keep dry, and you'll be fine. Anyway, guys, see you later. Well, guys, that's my Tim Hortons adventure. And I've got to say, this coffee isn't very good at all. So just don't get hit by this truck. No. See, in Canada... Fuck. See, in Canada, you can turn right or our left on a red light if it's safe to do so. It's a great idea. Because, my God, it would alleviate some traffic problems in Melbourne. The coffee... I don't know. Should have I had sugar with it? Jesus. Either way... It's not too good. I don't know if it's the butter caramel. Should I care? Um, should probably start getting used to Dim Hortons anyway. But a lot of other places do great coffee in Canada. It's, I think it's starting to catch on. 
The only thing uh, about this snow is it got heavier, which I didn't film, and then it gets lighter, and how do I drive in it? I've never driven in snow. Hopefully it just settles into water on the ground and uh, won't have to think too hard. But either way, in this sort of weather like you do in Melbourne, you just take it slowly. Anyway, guys, you're all complaining about the weather there, but trust me, it's nothing to what it is here, at least. I'll uh, sign out thinking of you all, and I'll catch you later.